Mike Klein here with chess.com following round eight's press conference. As you know by now, Nepomneshi has fallen down two games and there's only six remaining. One of the interesting aspects about this press conference was how much Magnus still believes in the butterfly effect. Recall a couple of rounds ago when he was asked would he change anything in his career and he basically said his career has turned out okay and changing anything might affect where he is at the moment. And he said today that round eight's win is actually kind of a culmination about what happened in round six. That being that both players were a little bit tired, but also that Jan may have felt the need to press a little bit. So that one mistake on move 130 in round six is still affecting the match almost 48 hours later. In fact, the players also had a couple questions about whether or not they were okay with the schedule. And Magnus, true to form as always, he said, yeah, it's more difficult on me. And yeah, I like it that way. So as if the man needs more challenges in his life, he's actually like, come on, Fide, throw something at me. I can handle pretty much anything. For Jan, well, a lot of internet chatter was praising him. Of course, B5 is nothing to be praised, but for his uh, reaction to the media, he's been dutifully coming out. He doesn't need any convincing to talk to me or the other media after the round. He was a professional. He was, you know, self-effacing after the game and uh, said he was, you know, played barely like, even like a grandmaster. Um, but again, he keeps on saying, match is not over. I'm fine psychologically. And finally, Maurice was like, well, you must have planned for this, you know, a contingency in case you were down two games, and he's like, nope, no, didn't plan for that. Uh, and I think you can't at the top levels. You can't plan to be down because then you admit that's a possibility. So we will see now. He does have to regroup. He has to plan for it now. Uh, they have a rest day to figure all everything out, and we're going to see what they come back with on Tuesday.